Hi, I'm Precious, and this is my art portfolio project, The Villains of Vinylmation. This is my Vinylmation box, which includes characters from my poster. Now you can see my custom Vinylmation box featuring scenes from Venice, Italy. Here is my clay Vinylmation of Cruella de Vil. This is my plush Vinylmation of The Queen of Hearts from Alice in Wonderland. Here is my Mickey Misfit plaster and my Cheshire Cat plaster. This is my Villains of Vinylmation poster. The title of my poster is The Villains of Vinylmation. My first Vinylmation is the Queen of Hearts and you can see in her dress she has red and black and the contrasts between the yellow and black are on the bottom and top and her crown really shows her power in the Alice in Wonderland story. My next Vinylmation is the Cheshire Cat from Alice in Wonderland and you can see the different purples and pinks in him and his mouth really gives him his character with his smile and he's a minimalist Vinylmation. The next one is Captain Hook, and he really has a different contrast in his colors, and his smile gives him his character as well. This is one of the evil twins from the movie Tangled, and his eye patch and scars on his face really builds his character. He is also carrying a sword that could be seen in his hand. His colors also symbolize his evilness. This is the queen from the movie Snow White, and her apple in her ear really gives her the whole idea of giving Snow White the poisonous apple. I also like the colors in her robes. This is Cruella de Vil from the movie 101 Dalmatians. She can be seen wearing her Dalmatian robe and the red in her ears and gloves really make her pop. The last Vinylmation is a cosplay Vinylmation, which means one character dressed up as another. In this case, it's the Wicked Witch from the West dressed up as Dorothy. She can be seen wearing her plaid dress with her braids in her hair and blue bow. Her ruby slippers really symbolize the Wizard of Oz story. This is my art portfolio Vinylmation box, and on the top you can see the print villain Vinylmation. I really like the font I did this in, and the apples found at the top and bottom really give it its character. I also like the black and white contrast and the red the apples give off. The next side is my personal favorite with a crocodile from the movie Peter Pan. This really shows Captain Hook being stuck in his mouth and the word Vinylmation going down his throat. The white background really makes the crocodile and the word Vinylmation stand out. The next side shows Cruella de Vil in her house with fallen petals and different things you would see on her wall with picture frames and lamps. I really like the mirror I did at the bottom right. The next side is of the Queen of Hearts from the film Alice in Wonderland, and she is the same one as on my poster. She still has her dress and cape and the crown on her head. The white background really makes her pop. My next side is of the Cheshire Cat from the movie Alice in Wonderland. He can be seen with a table with a tea set on it and a variety of colors in the landscape with purple flowers and blue in the trees. That's my box! Now it's time for the unboxing. My first project is my plush of the Queen of Hearts from the movie Alice in Wonderland. She's very similar to the one on my project because she has the red and black dress and the yellows on her too. The back of my plush is very similar to the front. It has the red and black in the dress and the hood on the back of the head. There's also the yellow in the ears and the shape of the hair is also like the front. And that's my Queen of Hearts plush. My next project is my Misfits Mickey. The colors I used in this one are red, black, yellow, and white. I splattered the paint and left some white spaces. I think I did a really good job on this one. The next Vinylmation is the Cheshire Cat from the movie Alice in Wonderland. It is the same one on my poster and filled with purples and pinks. This plaster is a minimalist, which means it has as few details as possible, but you are still able to tell which character it is. My Cheshire Cat is filled with flat color and good design.
This final mation is my Cruella de Vil plaster. It is filled with blacks and whites and the red which really makes it stand out. She is wearing her Dalmatian coat and red gloves. I used flat color and have good craftsmanship. My last project, and the one I think I personally did the best on, is my custom Vinylmation of Vinylmation in Venice. On the lid you can see the words Vinylmation in Venice, and inside you can see my Vinylmation. On the sides of my box you can see gondolas in the water of Venice, Italy, and an intricately painted boardwalk with a lantern. I really like the blues in the gondolas and the water. Now I will show you the Vinylmation on the inside of my box. On the front of my Vinylmation, there's buildings and a gondola that would be in Venice, Italy. And on the back, there's waves in the water and clouds. To me, the front of my Vinylmation is much better, and I really like how I outlined everything in black. Thank you again for watching. I'm Precious. I hope you enjoyed this video and make sure you like, subscribe, and leave comments.